Hello and welcome back to Boo Polo Channel. My name is Pascal. Today I am going to do a review of a Times Tools uh, wire cutter and stripper and looper also. Uh, the Times Tools one, uh, it's, it's curved, uh, it's, so it's easier in the hand. I've, I've reviewed the Irwin one there for you before, uh, which does crimping as well. This does not do crimping. But this one has a, a, a stay closed feature, a, a safety catch on it here. You see here? Uh, Klein tools are made in the United States of America. So uh, automatic ones, there's fully automatic wire strippers. They do not work with this type of wire here. This type of wire here is called TTHN, where there is a sleeve on the outside. Not just a wire, there's a... a, a fireproof, fire protection sleeve outside the rubber. So it can't pull the rubber. Whereas a normal wire here, uh, which you have here, flexible wire, or a lot of them are not TTHN. So uh, the, the wire I have over here is nearly always like this, and the automatic work ones do not work at, at all. Okay, so, uh, so there's, uh, what have we got on it? It, it? it gives you the gauge on the inside of it and it tells you the sizes. Now the solid is on, the, on this side, it, the, the marks of the solid is on this side and the strand is on this side because they're going to be one size different because stranded is the, wi the wire is more than in a solid one. There's also, a, a li uh, there's also one here for bending the wire, uh, looping the wire, I should say. So what we'll do is, I'll st uh, this is the, one of the most difficult ones to do. So I am going to, uh, uh, I'm going to do uh, a, a number, number 12 wire here, TTHN. Now, it is difficult to do this every day of the week, right? Especially if I'm going to do a big long one like this. You need to turn it because the sleeve on the outside. But look, it takes it off like this. I cannot do that with automatic one. And that's the, heavy, that's the biggest size now that we have on this. So then you can, you can make your loop here. You can put your wire in here to make a loop. You can strand it first if you want to. Uh, and then you just bend it around like that and then you have your loop like this I went in a little bit too far with it there but uh, you have your loop where you're uh, if you're going to put it in, in a screw around it or something like that you have your loop so doing the smaller wires uh, the softer wires uh, this is flexible wire uh, which you, you, we would call flex uh, that you would have in uh, maybe in an outlet I think this might be number 18 We'll try it on number 18, and we'll see how it goes. Yeah, that's fine. No strands left in it. No. Nope. And it's a good cutter as well, so you know you can do it again. With, 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 the, with the normal wire, you don't have to twist it so much, right? It'll just come off like that. And you can do it like this, and you can bend. Now, you can cut some bolts with this as well. You can cut 632 and 832 bolts here as well. Uh, I've demonstrated that before and, and it works fine. So, uh, but as I say, it just cuts off really easy and it's very quick for doing, doing your wiring, you know, like this and like that. If, if you're in a hurry, now I'll go, on to, I'll go on to a smaller size wire now, but this is TTHN as well, so there's a sleeve on it. I don't know, I'll show you up close. You can see the white part of the sleeve there. So that's not on all wires, but it is on TTHN, which is a regulation wire in some places. It's, uh, so what we'll do is we'll use the, uh, the next size down, which is uh, number, I think this is number 16. I am not sure. Yeah, this is number 16. It's not the next size down. It's much smaller. And it comes off real easy. The, uh, that's TTHN as well. I'll do it again. Number 16, I'm going to do a longer one this time for you. With the THN, uh, with the TTHN, give it a turn because you want, to, you want to slice the sleeve the whole way around. So, so then we can, you can use this to make this into a loop as well if you want to. Uh, but you can, it's easy to make a loop with something so small as that. So there's your loop. 
like that. So that's a uh, that's my uh, uh, that's my review of the Klein Tools uh, wire cutter. Uh, it, uh, as I said, it uh, it comes in blue and it comes in yellow. Uh, I like this one. I like the shape of the handle. This rubber is nice and soft in it. Uh, but if you're doing TTHN, or I'm not sure what there's a, there's a couple of other different names on the on the wire that has this the sleeve on the outside. You cannot use the automatic pull one. You can use the, the pull one with the different settings on it, but the auto range one, no, you cannot. It just, it just drags the outside, outer coat of it. So for this wire, yes, but for this one and this one, no. So that's why you need one of these or the other one that goes like, uh, click, like I will be doing later. I have a trying tool, uh, uh, oh, not fully automatic, semi-automatic, okay? So that's my review, short review, uh, on the Klein Tools uh, wire cutter and stripper. Uh, if you like this video or any of our other videos, uh, please consider subscribing.